It had to be snakes. Hey guys, Amy here on Dean News, feeling pretty squeamish talking about snakes today. I don't love snakes. I am creeped out that they have no arms or legs and that they do that slithery move thing. And let's not forget that some of them have fangs dripping with poison. Snake venom is terrifying. A snake bite can be laced with different venoms, some that initiate digestion of a prey even before it is swallowed by killing the muscle cells and tissues. Some venom causes the blood to congeal, preventing circulation and bringing death. And there are some venoms that attack the nervous system, shutting it down entirely or overloading it. Having said all that, I feel my fear of snakes is totally justified. And it turns out my fear of snakes is not only rational, it is one of the most common phobias, even among people who have never laid eyes on a snake. So how is that even possible? It all comes down to evolution. Psychologists studying this rampant fear of snakes have found that both adults and children can easily pick out images of snakes from a collection of other nature images showing things like frogs and flowers, which suggests that recognition is rooted in a survival instinct. The idea is pretty simple. Throughout evolutionary history, humans figured out pretty quickly that getting bitten by a snake was bad and learned to avoid them. This instinct was passed down through natural selection, favoring those who avoided the slithery killers. Some anthropologists have gone so far as to suggest that our acquired instinct to avoid snakes helped early primates develop better vision and larger brains that evolved to pay greater attention to snakes, one of humans' earliest predators, over other creatures. Another study in 2014 added credence to this idea that a fear of snakes is innate. The study involved 24 non-phobic Norwegian women between the ages of 18 and 31 who looked at color images with an EEG monitoring their brain activity. The snake images evoked a significantly stronger response, particularly in the brain's visual processing region. And so did spiders in this study, but less strongly. Research published in the journal Biological Psychology suggests that our equally common fear of spiders is learned rather than innate. Spiders aren't nearly as historically threatening to our safety as snakes are, so our aversion to these creepy crawlers stems from the fact that they are creepy crawlers. And yes, even though there are many species of snakes that are harmless to humans, your fear of snakes is still totally legit, and also a sign that, evolutionarily, you're doing all right. If you want to watch Trace handle a 100-pound python, make sure you check out this special episode of DNews. What is the difference between a python like Marge and an anaconda? Well, one of the big differences is uh, pythons have heat pits, mm -hmm. which helps them track down their prey in the jungle, and uh, anacondas are much more aquatic. Make sure to check that out. There's a link in the description if you're on mobile. So are you afraid of snakes? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more D News every day of the week.